Now let's try these double stops with a right hand roll pattern. This is going to make it start to sound like banjo playing again, I promise. So we start off with the G positions, and we're just going to go from the G position at 3 and 5 to the 8 and 9, the bar chord, this one and this one. We're going to use the Foggy Mountain Breakdown style roll, the Foggy Mountain roll. So this is the roll that goes 2, 1, 2, 1, 5, 2, 1, 5. So we'll play that roll through once on each one of these shapes. So we'll start with the G here at the 3rd and 5th fret. So one, two, three, four, then move it up, move it up to the next one, to the next one, and back down. Now let's try the same thing with all the C chord shapes. So starting at one and two, bar chord, 10th fret, and so on. So starting here, one, two, three, four, to the fifth fret, eight and 10, 13, 14, bar chord, F chord shape, and back down. And now let's try it all with D chords. So we start at the third and fourth frets and we play the Foggy Mountain Roll. Two, three, four. And back down. Practice those over and over again, get a little bit faster once you're a little more confident with where the double stop positions are, and just use that roll. It makes good use of both strings and it keeps the drive going too. And get used to those double stop positions and we'll show you how to apply them to some songs coming up soon.